That it should happen, in my effort to describe, to make you see, that I discover, as my narrator discover, as discovers, as my reader discovers, that love is redemptive, that it is a mystery that outruns time, physical change, mortality, much as our Christian faith tells us it does. Well. I'm as astonished at this as you are, as she is. This is not a message or a meeting I set out to discover or to illustrate or to confirm. It's simply what happened, what happens, when through the magic of art, through the grace of that holy trinity of writer, narrator, reader, a world is conjured via the written word, a world where the concrete shimmers with the light of the unseen, where life conquers death, where love redeems us. Is that what you intended to say, the chattering classes well may ask? As a practicing Catholic, do you think this is true? That the divine light shows itself through the ordinary objects of our everyday existence? Is that what you're trying to prove? I repeat my disclaimer. I set out to prove nothing. I know nothing about the real world. I cannot speak with certainty about what God does or does not do in it. But as one part of that holy trinity that constitutes the necessary and silent confluence of minds that transforms marks on a page into a world, I can point to what we see together in all its vividness and clarity, and say, as astonished as narrator and reader alike, astonished by love, by grace, by God in all things, look, it is there.